Greetings, I'm Mike Kensler with the Auburn University Office of Sustainability, and I want to welcome you to another edition of Books and Ball Caps, where I recommend a book related to sustainability and tell you about one of my many minor league baseball experiences by showing you one of my hats. So the book I want to recommend today is called Defenders and Dreamers. I've had this book a long time and I really love it. And I picked this one because we're coming up on the 50th anniversary of Earth Day. And what this book does is tell you the stories of 12 people who led to the modern environmental movement, from Henry David Thoreau up to Barry, Barry Commoner. It gives a summary of the life and times of people like Aldo Leopold and John Muir and Rachel Carson and Stephen Mather and John Wesley Powell and Frederick Law Olmsted. It's a very inspiring book of these people who are doing what they can to make the world a better place and laid the foundation for the sustainability work that's happening today. I highly recommend Defenders and Dreamers by Douglas Strong. The ball cap I chose today is from the Burlington Bees in Burlington, Iowa. Burlington's a small town that sits right on the Mississippi River, right across the river from Illinois. It's a great little ballpark. It's a single A team um, in the Midwest League for the Los Angeles Angels. And I picked this one not so much for the team, but for the for the mascot that they have, the bee, in relation again to Earth Day, because bees are one of the most important creatures on the planet. About a third of the food we consume requires pollination, and bees are the most dominant pollinator. The food they pollinate is worth hundreds of billions of dollars, and bees are at risk for any number of reasons, from, from pesticides to climate change to diseases that they face. So we really have to do a better job of protecting bees if we're going to have a livable future. So that's it for this edition. Get and read Defenders and Dreamers by Douglas Strong. And if you get the chance to find yourself in Iowa or traveling down the Mississippi River, stop in Burlington and see the bees. Till next time, I'll see you at the ballpark.